Hey friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. In this video tutorial, I will show you how to fix borderlands for crashing issue, crashes to desktop or crashing at a startup on PC. So without wasting any time, here follow the fixes. The first solution is to modify the game launch option. So open Steam and go to library, right click on borderlands for game and select properties. In the launch options, type minus DX11, then close the tab and then launch the game and check. If that doesn't work, then again go to the properties and in the launch option type minus DX12 and then close the tab and launch the game and check. If it's still not working, then again go to properties and then remove the command from the launch options and follow other fixes mentioned in this video. Second solution is to delete Borderlands 4 folder from documents and saved games folder. But take a note, you will lose game progress as well as saved settings hence keep the backup of the folder to the desktop first now go to the c drive users folder your username folder documents folder my games folder now right click on borderlands 4 folder and delete it then go to the c drive users folder your username folder saved games folder right click on borderlands 4 folder and delete it now you can launch the game and check Solution 3 is to switch Steam to stable version. To, to do so, open Steam, then go to Steam settings, then click on interface tab and next to client beta participation. If Steam beta update is selected, then select no beta chosen and then click on confirm and this will restart your Steam automatically and then you can launch Borderlands 4 game and check. Solution 4. Run Borderlands 4 as an admin. Open Steam, go to library, right click on Borderlands 4 game and click on manage browse local files. It will open the game installation folder. The path is C drive, program files x86, Steam, Steam apps, common, Borderlands 4 folder. Now open the oak game folder, binaries folder, win64 folder. Then right click on Borderlands 4 exe file and select properties and then go to the compatibility tab and then tick mark run this program as an administrator hit apply ok and then launch the game from the game installation folder and then check if that doesn't work then modify the compatibility settings again go to the compatibility tab then click on run this program in compatibility mode for windows 8 hit apply ok and then launch the game and check if that doesn't work then from the drop down select windows 7 then hit apply ok then launch the game and check if it's still not working then this time Select disable full screen optimization option as well then hit apply ok and then launch the game and check. Now if still your problem is not solved then again go to the compatibility tab then untick all these three boxes and hit apply ok and then follow other fixes mentioned in this video. Solution 6 update graphic card driver. So update your graphic card driver and then check if your problem is solved or not. If not then perform a clean installation of graphic card driver. So if you are having AMD driver, go to AMD website. If you are having NVIDIA card, then go to NVIDIA website. If you are having Intel card, then go to the Intel website. The links are given in video description. I'm showing the example of NVIDIA graphic card driver. So go to this NVIDIA website. Now once you are on NVIDIA website, here you have to select your version of graphic card driver, then select operating system and then click on find. The latest version will be on the top. You have to download this one GeForce Game Ready Driver. Click on View, then click on Download. And once this exe file get downloaded, then run the downloaded exe file and select Yes to allow, and then click on OK. You will see this screen. Click on Agree and Continue. Then select Custom Advanced option, then click on Next. Then tick mark Perform a Clean Installation box, and then click on Next. And after the clean installation of graphic card driver is done, restart your PC once and then launch the game and check. If still your problem is not solved, then you can also roll back your graphic card driver. If you run an NVIDIA GPU, then revert drivers back to version 577.00. If you run an AMD GPU, then revert back drivers to version 25.5.1. So I am showing the example. So if your PC run on then go to this NVIDIA website, select your version of graphic card driver and then click on find, scroll down and then click on view more versions. Now go to 577.00. You can see this one. So you have to download this one and install it on your PC. Now if you have AMD graphic card driver, then go to this AMD website. Now enter your version of graphic card driver version over here and then click on search. 
now click on previous versions expand windows 11 if you have windows 11 if you have windows 10 then expand windows 10 i have windows 11 now look for the version 25.5.1 so this is the 25.5.1 so you have to download and install it on your pc and after rolling back your graphic card driver you can then launch the game and check solution 8 allow borderlands 4 through firewall and antivirus so in windows search search for windows security and open it then click on virus and threat protection then click on manage ransomware protection then click on allow an app through control folder access click yes to allow then click on add an allowed app then click on browse all apps now browse to the game installation folder so browse to c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common borderland 4 open oak game folder binaries folder win64 folder select borderlands 4 exe file and click open to add it to the list then go back click on firewall and network protection then click on allow an app through firewall then click on change settings then click on allow another app then click on browse and then browse to the game installation folder browse to c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common borderlands 4 now open oak game folder binaries folder win64 folder select borderlands 4 exe file and add it after adding it make sure both private and public is ticked mark then click on ok to save changes now if you are using any third party antivirus program such as komodo avast casper sky evg maccafe not on bitdefender then allow the game exe to your antivirus program as well or you can also disable the antivirus program for a while and then you can launch the game and check Ninth solution is to run the game on dedicated graphic card driver so in windows search type graphic settings and open it then click on add desktop app and then browse to the game installation folder browse to c drive program files x86 steam steam apps common borderlands 4 oak game binaries win64 folder select borderlands 4 exe file and then click on add after adding it expand it click on drop down next to gp preference and select high performance then you can launch the game and check 10 solution is to close conflicting or unnecessary program so disconnect external usb drive mouse disconnect additional joystick controller multiple monitor connected to pc unplug the logitech or thrustmaster racing wheel and the task for afterburner river tuner hw info razor synapse or msi dragon center from task manager close all of your tab to free up ram and relaunch the game solution 11 is to verify the game files so open steam go to library right click on borderlands 4 and select properties go to installed files tab then click on verify integrity of game files and after the verification of the files has been done then you can launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not solution 12 is to disable overlays so open steam go to your steam library right click borderlands properties and then turn off enable the steam overlay while in game turn this off disable discord overlay launch discord on your pc then click on gear icon in the app bottom left corner click on game overlay on the left panel and then toggle off the enable in game overlay disable nvidia overlay open nvidia geforce experience settings general turn off in game overlay similarly disable overlay in all apps or close all other overlay apps such as geforce experience nvidia shadow play overlay amd overlay and then launch the game and check solution 13 install visual c++ files so go to this microsoft website link is given in video description scroll down download x86 and x64 version download both the version and then install both of them one by one click on x86 version now if you see repair option then click on repair if you see install option then install it and after installing both the x86 and x64 version then restart your pc and then launch the game and check if your problem is solved or not 14 solution is to update windows so go to windows settings on the left click on windows update and then click on check for updates and if there are any updates available then download and install it then restart your pc once and then launch the game and check solution 15 uninstall and reinstall borderlands 4 so if nothing seems to work 
then the last solution is to uninstall borderlands 4 from your pc then restart your pc and then reinstall the game you can install it on ssd drive and then check if you have installed the game in local drive then this time install it in external drive ssd drive and then check so i hope by following these solutions you will be able to fix borderlands for crashing crashes to desktop or crashing at a startup on pc problem so that's all for this video if this video helped you then please like and share this video and also subscribe to my youtube channel to get the latest updates thank you